new at noon. Parents and students in Woodland Park are protesting a decision to move sixth graders to an elementary school. The controversy comes one day after nearly 30 teachers called out sick. Caradio News Channel 13's Jessica Grunling joins us live from Woodland Park Middle School to explain how the district is responding to these protests. Jessica. Parents who came here with signs in hand tell me they feel ignored and they don't believe the Woodland Park School Board is being transparent or listening to teachers. But the president of the Woodland Park School Board tells me it's been a decades long plan to shift the middle school students. I'm a alumni, my whole family's gone through this district. Some of the things they're taking away from our children have been traditions for at least 20 years. Stephanie Merle is outside of Woodland Park Middle School protesting with her sixth grade daughter. We don't feel heard. We don't feel it's transparent. We don't know even how they come to these conclusions. There's a bunch of people who are planning on doing sports, clubs, all those different things, and now they don't probably won't get those because the elementary schools aren't big enough. Everyone here expressing frustration over the Woodland Park School District's decision to move sixth graders into the elementary schools next year. They came out with signs to support teachers who are now concerned about what this middle school shift means for their jobs. I know the people in our buildings and they are amazing and they have kids in their heart and I'm here to support them. I hope the teachers feel heard. I hope that their expertise and their education and their credentials are respected. School Board President David Rusterholt says the district has seen declining enrollment since 2012 with five of its schools only half full with students. But the district's newest school, Merritt Academy, which shares a building with the middle school, keeps growing. The school board vice president, David Illingsworth, refutes claims that it wasn't transparent about the process. And that there was a survey sent out to parents. Um, this has been consulted with our various school leaders, our principals and things like that. There was a feasibility study done with a third party that was hired by the previous superintendent um, that was done last year and was discussed as part of the uh, question about moving Merritt Academy into the middle schools. Inter interim Superintendent Ken Witt says the middle school shift is the best educational outcome for students, but he says the opinions of protesters out here today isn't the same sentiment from the community. Reporting live in Woodland Park, Jessica Grunling, KRGO News Channel 13. Thank you, Jessica. A shaky start to